This is the 20th Leak Code Challenge, and it is called Valid Parentheses. Given a string S containing just the characters uh, parentheses, curly braces, and square braces, determine if the input string is valid. An input string is valid if the open brackets must be closed by the same type of brackets. Open brackets must be closed in the correct order. Every closed bracket has a corresponding open bracket of the same type. So for parentheses, parentheses, that is true. Uh, this is true, and this is false. So the length of the string can be anywhere from 1 to 10,000 and it only consists of these type of parentheses. Okay, I'll go get the project set up. Okay, so my thoughts for this is we can use a stack which we add the opening parentheses into and then when there's a closing one we check to see if that matches the one at the top. If it does then we move it. If it doesn't then obviously it's not valid. And then when we've gone through every character in the string, we can check to see if there's anything left in the stack. And if it is, then it's invalid. So I've never actually used stacks. So this would be uh, interesting to do. So we got new stack here. We will do for each cast Z in string. We will do if C. Yeah, sure, we'll just do this because it's nice and quick. If it equals that, or C equals curly brace opening, or square. Yep, push C. So adding that there, else if C equals closing, how do we get from the top? That's what I want to know. Pop, I assume. Yep. So actually, we'll do else var opening equals pop. We will do if opening equals that and C does not equal the closing one, or just do the same thing with curly brace. And then same thing with square brackets. Uh, so I forgot the pipe. So if none of if opening equals this one, but it doesn't equal this, then we return false. Okay, what if oh, I only need to do one equals? Let's return false, and that's fine. Then at the bottom, we do if it's greater than zero return false, otherwise return true. Okay, I think that's all that needs to be done, so let's run it. Apparently there was an error. What did I do wrong? Oh, whoops, this is meant to be outside. Like that. Now we run it. Okay, so we can see we got true, true, and false. So it seems to be working. So let's copy this and put it into leak code. We'll do the test ones first, just to verify that's all good. Yep, those came up, and I'll submit. Okay, we've got an error here. Stack empty. Okay, we didn't think about that. So we will go here, else, we'll do if opening parentheses dot count equals zero, return false. Let's just copy and paste that into here, because it's nice and quick. And now let's retry it. Yep, so that's the solution to the 20th challenge on LeetCode, which is valid parentheses. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe.